So I went to my local hardware store and got some paracord and uh, a couple of pulleys and a carabiner and uh, got some treated 2x4 and this old round post. So thought I would install a clothesline. So let's get to it. So I'd like to be able to get to this from the porch instead of having to step down. So I've got this 2x4 that I'm going to be screwing along the side of the rail here. Uh, and that way I can just access uh, the washing machine and just step right outside and have the clothesline right there. So I've got the drill and some three inch screws. I just get this up. I don't think it would take but just a couple of screws to hold it in there. I'm going with a rather long board so that uh, nobody will be running into this clothesline when they walk around. I think I'll add one more screw just to uh, be safe. So I'm going to make this approximately 30 foot. So I'm going to use 60 foot of cord. I just got the post hole diggers here, and I'm going to make a, a hole for this post. Depending on how many rocks I hit, I'd like this to be about two foot deep. You're impeding progress. I'm gonna plop this pole down here. I'm thinking I hit somewhere around two foot. Looking pretty good. So I've got a stick here that I'm gonna use. Excuse me, ma'am. Ooh, to paint this dirt in. To hold the hardware on, I'm just going to put a screw right here in the top. Something to that effect. Now I had purchased this carabiner thinking I would have to have it up here, but these uh, actually slip over the screw, so I won't need that for this project. But I've got this cord and it's uh, 100 foot, but I figured if we use 60 foot for this 30 foot run, then we'll uh, have some left over for later. So anyway, I'm gonna unravel this, and then feed it through here, like that, and then we'll be able to go up the hill and uh, attach the other side. I believe I'm gonna do the same thing over here and just stick this up top here. Make sure that's got enough room to swivel around. Then just plop this on top like that and we should be ready to string this up. It never fails. Get this all tangled up and it'll be here forever. It's a good day to dry some clothes outside. Nice and hot. I finally got this mess untangled. So, make sure there's no kinks in this thing. Let's see up under here. So I'll probably have to tighten this a few times to make sure that it's uh, where it needs to be. But for now, I think I'll just tighten it in here and, and call it good. So I'm gonna cut this about here. And I probably should uh, 
burn this end off too. I got this tight and tied up and it seems to be holding on that screw pretty well. Uh, and once that weight's on there, it'll pull it back down. But uh, slides nice and smooth. I like it. And I left this string long so that I can come back and uh, tighten it up as this thing starts to slacken out some. For an initial test here, I'm seeing that uh, this will definitely have some slack as uh, wet things are put on here. Because just this dry shirt alone has stretched it out. So, I have to tighten that back up. Well, that concludes this video on installing a clothesline. I should be using this for years to come. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like and remember to subscribe. I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.